What's the distance? I'm going to fall all the way down. I'm going to do some kind of submission hold to be able to control them so that they can't move, whether that's even turning them over, put them in a position where I'm choking them out, or just stopping controlling this person's body, uh, or taking and moving out of the way or moving out of the situation once the situation has been taken care of. The first principle is awareness. I need to be able to aware of the person's size, their I have to size up their ability, say they're stronger than me, or they, they look like they're faster, they're quicker. What kind of advantage do they think that they have? What is it that they want from me? It's very important in my mind to think, what does this person want from me? We don't have a lot of time to discuss the psychology. We're already going to assume that the intent is already there, to where they could hurt or they could damage me in this. And But my mind is my most powerful weapon. My mind is my most powerful weapon, more powerful than my body itself. I need to be able to look at my surroundings to see how much room that I have around me. Could I be pushed? Can someone else come in? Are there other attackers? I need to, whatever that person is positioned, I need to know how, what weapons that could come from their particular attack. So they're standing position. He could come with this front hand coming at my face. He could come with some kind of kick or something at my body. He could come with a kick from a, as a back kick. It takes a little bit more time to get there. He could come with a hooking type punch. Boom. There's a couple of the variations. I need to be aware by the position of their body so that I can have my defenses ready. And in Jitsu, primarily we start out of a Shizen or a natural position, not giving him any indication of, of my ability to be able to defend myself. I can immediately move into those positions, no matter what is attack that's coming, taking myself slightly offline, already hitting, controlling, taking this person off balance, using that proper distancing, once I have them off balance, get them striking, hitting, I can do whatever I choose to do, no matter how devastating, depending on the particular situation. The rip could gouge, could break, snap, control, destroy, even going to them. It is subduing, controlling, hold on this earth. To make sure that I have them in a position where they can't get up or they can't move, uh, and I'm in a safe position myself, so I can move away safely, no matter what. On this Combat Ninjutsu videotape, we're going to show you some dynamic action against several different kinds of attack. First, if a person comes up and they're doing just a one-handed push on someone. The other is they come up and they're doing a double-handed push on somebody. Then we're going to show the person actually has a grab a hold of somebody with one hand. Then we're going to show grabs against both hands, defenses. Then we're going to show if a person gets here with one and they're going to throw some kind of punch or something off of that, that grab. Then we're going to show some things against different kinds of kicks. Okay, Maybe a roundhouse kick. Maybe again, sweep against the leg, spinning, hitting, different kinds of attacks, maybe some multiple type punches. And then we're going to go through some attacks with cutting with a knife or a blade, some defenses against stick hits, and uh, disarms against those kind of things. Showing you a wide variety of different kinds of attacks and angles of attacks and how to quickly get that done. Fast, quick, it's got to be fast, quick, fast, and fast. Okay, and very, very devastating. You don't have a lot of time to hang out. If a person's punching at you several different times, trying to hang out in here, trying to get away from these kind of things. Ah, oh, sooner or later they're going to be able to tag you. You have to be able to go from here, of course, boom, but they do strike you really hard in the body. I am going to need to, to finish this quick, fast, and very devastating to where they're out on this technique. But I don't want to put myself in that position. I want it to be where if they're throwing a punch, boom, it's already in here. It's already done. It's already finished before there's time for anything else to happen.
Ah. <laughs> 